All right, so um, I made a previous video about Mona showcasing her and everything. I was doing everything wrong. All right, I learned a couple new things about her since that video. So the first thing I learned is that she has an internal cooldown um, because she applies two different instances of Hydro. Um, I didn't realize that, but it makes sense now. What happens, right, is she applies Hydro when she first uses her burst, you know, after the animation. The second instance of Hydro is when her mark, her bubble thing, explodes. So, there's an internal cooldown in which it applies Hydro in between those times. I've been doing it wrong and haven't been, you know, properly causing a vape reaction for bigger numbers. And another reason why I haven't is because of a thing called poise damage. This is basically an attack that will do enough to explode Mona's bubble. And I've been using Shongling before using Mona's burst. So her Pyronado thing is already going by the time Mona's burst is done. And that like instantly explodes Mona's bubble. And the issue with that is I'm not giving enough time for the internal cooldown to cause a vape reaction. So I'm not getting the biggest numbers I could get. So yeah, I hope that all makes sense to you. <laughs> this video is going to be about Mona again, but we're going to see bigger numbers. Oh yeah. So the build we're using here is um, we're using a four piece emblem set, which is probably her best set that you can use on her. We're still using Lost Prayer because crit rate, we need that. So we got 57 crit rate and 203 crit damage. All right, not too shabby. All right, um, first boss I want to actually test this on. Well, I guess I'm right at her right now. So let's just go fight right and Shogun in here. All right, I'm gonna quickly eat some crit rate food because I'm scared I won't hit crit. Alright, so, see, we apply Pyro right here, then we apply Hydro, and it causes that to vaporize, then, this should activate soon, 56, it didn't crit, sadly, alright, wait for round two, yeah, so it's hard to get that bubble to activate on, uh, Raiden Shogun, so I think I have a plan, um, I'm gonna activate Mona's thing first, and then I'll use Bennett, so Bennett's burst lasts a little longer, so, activate that, come on, yeah, 184. There we go. Let's test Rubik's Cube. Alright, so we're gonna do this. Applies Pyro. Then do that. Causes fate. Wait two seconds. Alright. 83k vape. Dude, that would have been a lot of damage if it crit. Well, it so would have. Pyro. And that. Wait two seconds. 252 that that's a lot of damage no that's a lot of damage holy crap 300k maybe i think that was my highest crit by the way like ever hold on hold on give me a minute give me a minute let me find it yep mona was my highest crit it was previously zhongli but holy crap we're gonna try elemental mastery this time to see if i can actually maybe I don't know, get more damage? Maybe? So we got 247, 80, 165. Do we really need that much crit rate though? Fifty-three, two fifteen. Gosh, Mona is so good. The fact that I hit my highest crit means that she is just really good character. She's so good. All right. Boom. Boom. Wait two seconds. 238. Hmm. I'll try again. All right. Boom. 
Just want to see. I didn't get the buff. 220. So our highest hit was 238. Okay. So EM is not the way. Or it could be the fact that I changed from the weapon. So we'll go back to this. Do I really need that much crit rate though? Under crit rate it is, I guess. Alright. Boom. One fifty-eight? Huh. Let's try that. Sixty-three, one eighty-seven. Yeah, let's try it again. Boom. One, two. Eighty-four. Didn't crit. Eighty-three crit rate, and I didn't crit. How's that even possible? All right. Boom. One, two. Two forty-two. Okay. Alright, let's leave, let the boss respawn, then we're going to use some food buffs. You crit rate food once again, just in cases. Hydro damage bonus. Okay. Boom. Wait, three, there we go. 193? How, I, how did I do less damage now? How did I do 252 without food buffs? Guys, I'm really confused. Pretty sure I'm using the same artifacts and everything that I used the first time. Oh, what the hell? Yo, get away from me, bro. Oh my gosh. Boom. Okay. 63. What is going on? What happened to my damage? I was using the right stuff, right? This is the artifacts I was using. How am I hitting less? With food buffs. I really want to try something. All right, was it was it floor seven? Do that. All right. Um, let's go. Boom. One, two. Okay, this bastard. We'll do that. One, two. Two forty-eight. All right. I just want to retry one more time. One, two. 248. Okay, so 248 is the highest. Here's here's the plan. We're going to go back to EM. Alright. And see how much that does. Also, Cursed Mona, by the way. One, two. 237 switch back to Witsith. 53 215 by destiny. 1 2 yes. What the hell? Let's retry that. I think since he was in an animation of putting his uh shield up, it didn't do poise damage. Upon you. Boom. 322 that's 300k baby oh my gosh holy crap i wonder though since i was using witsith i got a certain buff it could have been anything could have been the 60 percent attack maybe the elemental damage by 48 maybe more em i really don't know it's super inconsistent and i kind of don't like that about witsith but you know, when when you do hit those numbers, it's nice and you can't really complain, right? Okay. Boom. What buff do we have? Do we have any kind of buff? I don't know. One, two. 260! Okay, I'm happy. Okay, so that's definitely a damage bonus. Now, let's go back to the Spiral Abyss real quick. I think my last video on here, I hit only like 85k. But I wasn't also doing it right, so just get everybody over here. I don't care if they destroy it. One, two. Fifty-six. One seventy-nine. Alright, come here, bozos. Alright, let's go. Boom. One, two. 
184. 184! Oh my. I kind of don't want Zhongli's Dong over there because I feel like... I don't know if that does poise damage or not. It probably doesn't, but... Just in case. One ninety four. I'm just doing more and more damage each time I do it. We are gonna take this off, okay? Forty nine to twenty six. Let's just see. One two. Three forty three. One two. One eighty. That. 392! What the f Is this cheating for getting that, like, so much damage? Is it cheating? One, two, three, forty-three. I still think it's insane how I'm able to hit that much damage. Mona is insane. If this is, like, any sign for you guys to, like, build Mona, I don't know what else will be. I mean, I know this place is kind of cheating for, like, damage testing. But, uh, still. Three forty-three. So, three ninety something was my highest, and that's gonna be it. Three ninety-two, my highest crit. So this is just a normal circumstance. Maybe, maybe you're just wanting to, you know, farm cryo regis vine. So you're over here farming, you know. Nothing too crazy about it. You do that. You go. Boom. Wait two seconds. And not hit crit. Another situation for you. You know. You want to do your weekly boss. You know. Fight. One of the coolest bosses in the game. You go. Boom. You go like that. I don't think it. did it not apply to him did it was he barely out of reach then that then 200k that is insane so yeah i recommend building mona she is great so good in fact that she allowed me to hit my highest crit thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed if you want to see more subscribe take care and of course how about you subscribe to Kiro and come back for the next